Hello, this is Candace with MySpockLife.com. Thank you for joining our good book series. Today's good book is The Dressmaker of Kahir Kana, a book written by Gail Lemon. Gail went to Afghanistan right after the war on terror began, after the 9-11 attacks. She was writing a research paper about women who built successful businesses practically underground in the face of terrorism and war. And she went to Afghanistan to find some of these women. Even though it was very difficult, she came across a very inspirational lady who began a business as a dressmaker after the rise of the Taliban. When the Taliban came to power in Afghanistan. Kabul is where the lady lived with her family. She was a student, but when they came to power, women lost all of their rights. They could not be seen on the streets. If they were on the street, they had to be covered from head to toe in a garment that did not even show their eyes. They also had to have a male relative present. If they were seen speaking to a man that was not their relative, they could be beaten. They're, they could be re beaten for any number of offenses just because they were a woman and they were in public. This lady managed to build a thriving business for herself and for her five sisters, in addition to supporting her father, her mother, and her two brothers. She also started a school for other women who needed to have a business as well. And she started a school for them to learn how to sew and how they could find work as dressmakers. It was a very powerful, encouraging story because so many times we as women or as people living in developed nations feel that there are so many things that are against us and we cannot succeed. We can't do anything for our family. There's no room left for us to survive and to become successful. And we need to look at the lives of other people to realize how blessed we are in our own situation and that we can make a difference and there is something we can do. This, my friend, is why I read. I read because it opens my mind up to the possibilities and I want you to read as well. Make a commitment to reading a good book 15 minutes every day and it can change your life. Thank you for watching our good book series. Make sure that you continue to watch our videos, subscribe so that you can know what's going on over here at My Spock Life. Visit our website, myspocklife.com where we write about what we're doing and we offer encouragement to you so that you can go out and do something positive as well. Follow us on Instagram at myspocklife.com and I look forward to hearing from you. Feel free to leave a comment in the section below.